Good morning. Hey guys, it's Lauren here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I have a few things going on today, but not much. I'm basically, I want to stop at a book thrift store, which I've never done before. I'm honestly trying to get more into thrift stores just because I feel like you find more unique items there. But I want to get a few more books so I can start 2020 like reading more books. So I went to like go out there and check out whatever it is that they had and hopefully there be books that I'm interested in. And then I also wanted to see if I could find Christmas gifts from my siblings there. Hopefully they aren't watching this. If you are, you don't know this, you didn't hear the last five seconds. But anyway, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. And then I also have an Inklings, uh, my school creative writing club meeting today. And I haven't been in two weeks, so I really need to make sure I go to that, especially since I'm running it. So that's what I'm gonna do. And then let me just show you my outfit. You loo. I am wearing white long sleeve shirt from H&M. Uh, these pants, these khaki pants from Forever 21. Uh, the red Converse from Converse, obviously. I actually got them from Journeys, but you know, they're red Converse. You could get them anywhere. And then also these earrings, which are pretty cool. These face earrings that I got from H&M. It's really cute and I really like it. And since I'm taking out my hair in like a couple of days, I'm really excited to wear it then. And just like this necklace that I wear all the time. Yep, that's pretty much the fit. Anyway, moving on.
back in business. Mm. Okay, so I got home a few hours ago, but my brother just came in from New Orleans. So I was distracted for a good three hours, but it's whatever. But I went to the library, I went to the thrift store. It was all fun, good, fun. I had a pretty good day, actually. See, this is when I know I'm in the right job thing, even though it'll probably cost me a few um, few uh, luxuries when I'm older and I have to depend on myself. But it's the fact that I was like so happy being surrounded by books and just like reading and knowing that I'm like actively trying to be as literate as possible. That shit makes me so happy and like a whole other level and I can't even begin to explain it. But yeah. I am home and I want to start writing a blog post the first time ever. Oh, <laughs> I guess I should explain. I have a blog. Um, if you want to check it out, it's always linked down below. And it's sort of a fiction blog, but I want to change it a little because I want to keep more of my stories. I'm still going to share my stories, but I want to keep more of them to myself just because I feel like I want to publish someday. And someday those might be some short stories I want to publish. So. I will be publishing a few, but not all of them, of course, on the blog. So instead, I want to do a few more blog posts related to like, it's going to be like a personal blog, so it'll be like based on like whatever thoughts I have during the week. Some of them might even involve fan fiction because I'm that person. I, I, I admit it. I admit it. I'm going to be honest. So um, I'll probably just do more, I guess, informative like entertaining but also informative posts that involve that. So like analyzing fandoms, um, I guess like stuff about like student lifestyle, things like that. I'll probably publish things like that on my blog. So if you're interested in that, you should check it out. It's always linked down below. I'm gonna work on a post right now and probably watch something. I don't know what I wanna watch. I kind of want to watch Gossip Girl, but it's like something I like to focus on completely because I love Gossip Girl for a whole, uh, for my whole heart. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Oof, hi. Just a few more things before I end the vlog. I forgot to show you what I got from the thrift store. And I have it right here. And it's a little tote bag that I got, which is so cute because it says, Books turn muggles into wizards, the Harry Potter lines. And since I'm a huge Potterhead, I enjoy this very much. And I also think it's true. Books bring a certain magic into the world. I just want to show you guys what I got. So, the first thing I got was this. I honestly mainly got this for the aesthetic, but I also really wanted to read it because in my English lit class last semester, we read a lot of gothic literature. So, when I saw this, I thought, why the hell not? Eventually I'll just like read it. And it's The Seven Gothic Tales by Isaac Denson. Hopefully it pronounced that correctly, but this is what it looks like. And it just, back cover to, I don't know, just like the lettering and like the text. Like it smells like an old book. It looks like an old book. I really enjoy that. And I feel like reading this is just something I really like to read in my cafe when I'm traveling. Just something to take my mind off things. And let me just show you guys a certain page that reveals why I got it for the aesthetic quality. Yeah, there you go. See, look. This is the beginning of a page, right? This is the beginning text of a page. And then this is how it starts. It's like from those really old stories, and I really enjoy it. I really enjoy the aesthetic of this. And you'll probably peep on my Instagram. By the way, if you don't already follow me, you should follow me at the Creative Lauren Chi. It's a good time. I post excerpts, movie reviews, book reviews, pictures of myself. It's like a refined Finsta. It's a good time. But anyway, next book that I got. Also, if you know me, this isn't really a surprise. It, it makes sense, complete sense of my personality. I'm a huge comic book fan. So I ended up getting this book, which is basically the novel version of the series of comic books concerning Superman and his life and death. And it's called The Death and Life of Superman. It's written by Roger Stern. It has a 4.1 out of 5 on Goodreads. And it's 
supposed to be really, really good. And I just watched a ton of clips of Smallville, so I find myself like growing more and more fond of Superman because I'm a Batman girl. That's just a fact of life. But I'm also starting Superman is starting to grow on me. So I got this novel. I'm really looking forward to reading it because I need my daily dose of superheroes. So. Yeah, that's what I got, and then also another superhero thing. I got uh, the JLA, which is the first copy of the series, I believe. I saw the second copy, but I didn't want to get the second copy because I figured I wouldn't care that much. I don't read many of the Justice League books, surprisingly. I read a lot of Batman comic books, and I read a lot of individual like Wonder Woman, Superman, those kind of comic books, but never really the Justice League. So, Justice League of America, really glad that I got it, and it just looks so old time. Look at it. If you read comic books, you know that like, if the paper is like this, then it's very old. Cause now it's like, an almost like shiny, uh, more sturdy paper, but this is like, paper. <laughs> it's so cute, and I really like it. I'm very excited to read it. So, that is all. Uh, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, you should like, comment, and subscribe. Um, my content is starting to grow more and more book-like, but I also still do just my, my daily dose of spontaneous, fun, whatever the hell I feel like it, so it's a fun time. You should subscribe, and that's all I have for you. Um, it's been fun, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.